Oh man, I wish. I wouldn't mind doing an actually complete, complete, complete car. That would be, that's the best way to do it, you know, so you can have everything how you. The guy I work with is uh, doing a ground up restoration of the 69 Camaro. Really? And he, I mean, like, he knows how to do all the fun. He can weld himself on something like that. Yeah. I mean, there's stuff that he definitely gets sent out. Like, if it's if it's a weld where it's a very visible one and you know it's got to look good, 
he'll go, hey, I got a guy that'll come and do like a really good, good looking weld, you know. Mm -hmm, so, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But, so he basically trying to do his whole mm -hmm. setup himself, like his creation of. Yeah. Hey, that is awesome. I mean, he's, he's making it stop. Don't get me wrong. But it's all. Like, he, he is completely redoing everything, and he uh, he sent out and got like the original stock, like factory stickers and all that stuff. So everything is. I mean, he's actually got the old illegal as hell factory paint. And <laughs> Oh man! But you know what? Sometimes always stock. Most people you would think when you get a car like that, let's go ahead and put eleven hundred, fifteen hundred. When it's stock, it'll yeah. sell more. Oh, when it, yeah. you know, what? yeah. yeah. <laughs> so that's the good thing. Yeah, it'll resell for. And some of those collectors, they don't care for all of that stuff. Here's the thing. I, I mean, the way I look at it is this: when it's a stock car. Mm -hmm. You know, stock, not a stock car, but you know, when it's all stock, you know, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it's you appeal to all the people who are like, yeah, I want the mm -hmm. original look, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you do a custom look, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. you're limited. You're limited because people have to like the same custom vision that you have. Mm -hmm. Exactly, yep. exactly. And see, and that's another and thing. Let's face it, not everybody's chip boots. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 